to the people of Kwara State, Mokinyo, and Lefa. It gives me very great pleasure to join you all in the celebration of my dear brother and friend, Dr. Muhammad Ali Mi Abdul Razak, as he receives today the title of Mutawali of Ilori in this special turbaning ceremony. This is an illustrious title indeed, made all the more so by the preeminent standing of this great emirate, the ancient sharpening stone that has for centuries played host to an intersection of tribes and religions, a political and economic powerhouse whose towering stature still commands respect on both sides of the Niger. In many ways, Ilori is a symbol of the strength and beauty that comes from a synergy of cultures. And as such, the title of Mutawali is not only a great honor, but also a great trust, one which after wise and careful consideration has fallen on Dr. Muhammad Alimi Abdul Razak. Perhaps one of the great tragedies of history and time is the inability of people sometimes who have been chosen for great offices to rise to the stature of the office. The repercussions are often sharp and enduring, diminishing the man and the office along with him. But there are momentous occasions where hope and history rhyme, and a man is chosen who gracefully ascends to the height of the responsibility of that office. Today, now, we are in one such moment, as clearly evidenced by the pedigree and accomplishments of Dr. Muhammad Ali Mi Abdul Razak whom I've had the privilege of knowing up close. We were classmates at the law school and have been friends since for the past over 40 years. His track record of excellence and service in the legal, business, and public spheres are well known to all. His accomplishments in law, his house of the law firm of the House of Laws, his accomplishments in education, the establishment of Bridge House College with his dear wife, his participation on the board of FMB Holdings, and so many other accomplishments. These are a testament to the quality, to the quality of Dr. Alimi Abdul Razak. But he follows in the succession of his great father, Alaji Abdul Ghani, who follow on show Abdul Razak, senior advocate of Nigeria the first Mutawali of Ilori, and the first lawyer in Northern Nigeria, and the first senior advocate here in Enquara State. Clearly, the apple does not fall far from the tree, as they say. We can all attest to the fact that the new Mutawali of Ilori brings many qualities to the, type, to the title. A first-class mind who has navigated the legal profession and the complex world of business and politics at the highest level possible strictly on the merit of his own capacity and the weight of his contributions. But what stands him out indispensably, particularly for this role, is his compassion and his belief in the upholding of human dignity at all levels. Some may not know that his PhD thesis on human rights protection in Africa set the framework for the establishment of the African Court of Human and People's Rights which was commissioned by the Organization of African Unity, which is now the African Union. Years later, in the same spirit, he founded the Nigerian Council for Human Rights, serving as executive secretary for many years. The extent of Dr. Abdul Razak's philanthropy is a matter of public record. His investments, as we've said, in education, ensuring that as many people as possible within his sphere of influence get quality education and a good shot at a better life have earned him deserving laurels and awards, both at home and abroad. But the title of Mutawali of Ilori, no doubt, finds a natural home in this great believer in humanity and supporter of many. And we pray that God Almighty will grant you the wisdom and capacity to take on this responsibility with the same commitment, the same grace, the same compassion and selflessness with which, which, which you have borne your illustrious career and extensive accomplishments so far. Congratulations, Mutawali. God bless you. I also want to thank especially 
our dear father, the Emmy of Eloring. We all know, we all know, and we, some of us are very partial to the Emmy of Eloring. Because the Emmy of Lauren shares the same profession with some of us who are here. Uh, and I see the senior advocates on my right who are seated there fully in support of our Emmy. Those of us who are not from Lauren here feel a part of Lauren because of our dear father, the Emmy of Lauren, whose competence and accomplishments as a legal practitioner and as a court of appeal judge, not just any type of of uh, not just any type of accomplishment, but a man of integrity, a man known for his integrity, known for his commitment. So I want to, so I also, so I want to come, I just want us to, I just want to commend the, the Emir for all that he has been doing through the years and for the great service that he's been doing, not just to this state and to this kingdom, but to our entire nation. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you. I also bring you uh, lastly, the very, very warm felicitations of His Excellency the President of Nigeria, President Muhammad Buhari, who congratulates you today and congratulates this great kingdom on the installation of the second Mutawali of Ilori. God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you very much.